my lovely gems welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be doing a homeware haul slash pr unboxing i feel like i haven't done any kind of homeware haul and update for quite a while i think my last one was like maybe four months ago or something ridiculous like that i decided to yet again give you guys a bulk update some things i've purchased and other things i've actually been sent so i'm really excited and i've got a box down here that i haven't even opened yet i've saved it to open on camera but first Firstly, I want to start off with like the most obvious thing. If you guys are law subscribers, you will notice something in my background that you've never seen before. My two bedside mirrors. In my tour video, I told you guys what my plans were for this room and that I was going to add mirrors. And I actually said this last year when I moved in that I would add mirrors. These were a gift, so I'm really sorry guys. I can't tell you where they're from, I do not know. However, I will browse around the internet and find some similar mirrors and link them down below for you guys so you guys can get a similar look if you really do like the mirrors. But of course, I'll insert some close-ups for you now. They're just so beautiful and classic. I mean, they were a gift and they were honestly the perfect gift. I think they just match my room perfectly. Quite a chic European vibe to them whilst also remaining quite modern because of the colour. They're not overly detailed, they've got just the amount of detail that I really like and honestly they just pop and blend so so well with my bedroom with my bedding with my cushions it just looks so uniform I put them in line with my headboard as obviously if I had them higher than my headboard it would look a bit odd and every time I walk in my room I'm honestly still shocked that they're there it just makes my room look really luxurious and almost like a hotel boutique kind of vibe I absolutely love it okay so moving on to an accent chair if you guys follow me on snapchat and instagram you would have have seen that I moved things around in my living room and actually ended up attracting a new accent chair. So the wall that I plan to have an accent chair on, which is where my shelving unit has been since I moved in here, I actually moved the shelving unit to another wall and put my pink accent chair there with my mirror, just to get a vibe of how the room would feel. Literally four days later, my dad messaged me and said he was browsing around on Gumtree and came across an accent chair and matching stool. And he sent me the picture and said, do I like this? Is this the kind of thing I'm looking for? And I could not believe my luck that it was literally what I wanted. It's velvet, it's not crushed velvet, so it doesn't match my sofa, but it's the same kind of vibe. I didn't want a crushed velvet chair. I mean, that would be OTT. <laughs> it blends so well with my living room. You guys know my house is silver, grays, and white. The matching stool as well fits perfectly just in front of the balcony door, and I absolutely love the vibe of having it next to it. I'm now on the hunt to find like a really light white furry throw of some sort that would really pop against the silvery gray tone of the material. It's actually from made.com and it's a sold out piece and the person actually bought it and then realised that it was actually too big for their space so they were selling it and I actually got it for half of the price. It retails together at £400 for the chair and the store. I got them both for £200 so I am just in or absolute, absolute awe, you know, that I was able to just get that so quickly. And so now my living room is coming together. I'm not gonna be keeping the mirror behind it. That's gonna find a new home. I do need some help from you guys to decide on what to do above the chair. I am thinking to put maybe one or two floating white shelves there and just adding some cute little ornaments. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys my beautiful, beautiful velvet accent chair and stool. I absolutely love it. So now let's move on to, I guess, a PR package from Next Home. I'm I'm looking at this stuff beside me because I'm so in awe. I did open everything. I'm trying to complete my kitchen now, so I thought I would stick to kitchen wear and kitchen accessories. Well, the first thing I got actually isn't for the kitchen. Beautiful chrome clock. I absolutely love it. It's got a little handle up here, so it just makes it feel really, really classic. You guys can see it blends perfectly with my home. I'm actually going to be keeping this on my windowsill in my living room. It just looks perfect there. I haven't actually put a battery in the back yet, but once I do, this will be up and running and working. And I just love having Having clocks in my home I think they just add that modern but classical sort of vibe in a home I will leave the price on the screen and I'll also leave all of the links down below for you guys to purchase if you're interested moving on then to the kitchen stuff that I got from next this is so exciting so you guys know I've got the copper accents in my kitchen and I've actually decided to start adding some marble into my kitchen so the first thing that I got is these can you guys see how beautiful these mugs are? They've got really cool slogans like, let's do this, coffee is my friend. Well, it isn't really, I prefer hot chocolate. <laughs> Um, start the day happy and all I need is tea. I do love teas as well. Cute slogans on either side and what I absolutely love is that, you know, they come together with this copper. I've left this just beside my kettle so I can use one of these to have my morning tea or my evening tea, 
because I have tea throughout the day really. I love the copper and the marble together. So let's move on to the second marble piece and um, I've had my eye on these for quite a while. Wasn't quite sure whether they were a necessity because I have loads of these already but in white. I'm talking about this marble plate dining set. Okay so first of all you have the bowl. You then have the saucepan. I don't know if you guys can really see properly but there you go. And then we have the big plate on the bottom. So isn't that just stunning? You get four plates, four saucers and four bowls in the set. I thought these would be a great addition to my kitchen because I've actually add these plates particularly to my dining table. So where I used to have my plain white ones, I'm now using the marble ones. I decided to choose these gray placemats and they're two-tone. This is the light color and then this is the darker color. And they also come with matching coasters, dark and light. You get four placemats and four coasters in the pack. I decided to turn them over to the light colour. Isn't that so beautiful? Oh my gosh. I'm in love. I'm actually in love. Now I would say that my dining area is pretty much complete. The only thing missing is that I need some sort of like grey runner. So if you guys see anything that you think would go really well with my dining area, please do let me know. The last thing from my next package are these very, very cute baskets that I chose for my pantry because as you guys know I'm going to be decorating and redoing and reorganizing my pantry because quite frankly right now it's just a hot mess and it's really hard and you know you forget the things you have because they're all the way at the back behind all the tins and cans and bottles and pasta and everything. So I had the random idea to test out these two grey wicker baskets. Wow. I thought these would be really good additions to my pantry because they're quite spacious inside and they're quite long and rectangular. They've got handles just over there. So I thought they'd be great to like store loads of things in, like maybe bottles and stuff. I will keep you updated on how these baskets go because I have a great idea in my mind. I think I'm gonna get some more baskets, maybe some copper things as well, you know, just so that it all looks really nice and uniformed in the kitchen. I will definitely do a separate video on all of that. Another thing that I need to share with you guys, I actually currently have in my bedroom, however, I don't know if this is going to be its permanent home. This amazing, amazing canvas from Shop Cocoon. They reached out and asked me if I'd be interested in a canvas for my home, particularly because they are a Christian brand and I am a Christian and so I decided to personalize this. One of my favorite verses is Psalms 46 verse 5 which is this. God is within Jade, she will not fall. God will help her at break of day and I think this is an amazing canvas and quote just to be able to have vision and sight of this every morning is just like a great reminder and a great way to start the day. So they do canvases in various different sizes, small, medium, large, big and they do personalization and you can literally choose whatever you like and different styles. I obviously, I'm quite boring, I went for a white background with a grey writing because it blends perfectly with my home. But if you are not as boring as me and you have different, you know, colours and things going on in your home, you can literally personalise to your heart's content. You can get different backgrounds, you can get something with a border, with a picture behind the writing, like all sorts. I'm going to leave their links and information down below for you guys to check them out. So now I'm really excited because this is the first time I've opened a PR box you know something that's been sent to me I've never ever done you know a PR unboxing and I've always always wanted to quite frankly I'm not a huge blogger so I don't get a lot of stuff in my PO box I don't even have a PO box this box I knew I had to save when I opened the top I felt really guilty so I stopped and I said I'm going to save this for the video so this has caused me to film this video really quickly because I'm so so intrigued as to what is inside this box now the company are called the decor box and I think you can also find them on Instagram and what they essentially are is a subscription set service for home wear and home accessories. I think this idea is absolutely amazing. Every single month, you know, you have a subscription and you get a box like this and it comes in the post and it's filled to the brim really filled to the brim with a lot of home accessories and things that are going to help you know lifestyle things and accessories and stuff and they said to me if things don't necessarily suit my home I can give them away so whatever doesn't suit my home in here I am going to add to a big giveaway hamper that I will be doing when I reach 20,000 subscribers and I'm almost at 17 now so you guys help me push and get to 20 so let's get inside and let's have a look I'm going to actually show you guys that it's filled to the brim as you can see so this is gonna be so messy, but let's just do it anyway. I'm getting anxiety seeing all of this stuff on the floor, but it's worth it. Right, so I've got a card here which says home decor and lifestyle subscription box, and they're called the decor box. And the owner is Aisha Smith. 
Hi Aisha, and then I've got all her details on here. I've got this here, and it basically says, you know, what's in my September decor box. I'm so excited. Let's get open in this box. Right, I've got a weekly checklist. I literally write a weekly list every Sunday. Like today, once I've finished filming, I'll write a list of all the things that I plan to, you know, accomplish and achieve this week, all things that I need to do, um, emails I need to respond to, all of that. Uh, it's Monday, not everybody loves Mondays. Only Tuesday. Hump day, which is Wednesdays, almost there, which is a Thursday, and yay Friday. Like, come on, I literally call Fridays Fry Yay. It has loads of tick boxes, which I love because there's something about ticking off the things that you've accomplished every day. I don't know what it is, but it's great. And it looks like there's quite a lot in this pad. <sighs> right, let's open these. I think I know what this is now. There's so much in here. Wow. And it smells so nice. Oh my gosh, I've got mugs as well. Oh my goodness. There's so much stuff in here. Okay, we're gonna open all of this stuff. I'm gonna take everything out so that you guys can really see everything. Right, let's open this. amazing copper box I was just talking about you guys this is going to be perfect for the pantry this is a small size and then we've got a slightly bigger one as well I'm actually in awe you guys I don't know if I can give any of this to you now because it actually all goes in my house and then we've got the bigger one this is amazing so we've got the small one and the big one oh my god by the way these baskets are from sass and bell which you can see just there. So if you guys are interested in these baskets, go and get one. Or if you're interested in the whole subscription box, these are in the September box, so I don't think it's too late to get. These are gonna be perfect for the pantry along with the grey wicker baskets. I'm like, I don't need to go and find any now. I've got a big pile of stuff going on by my heater. Right, okay, let's open this one. Everything smells like strawberries and cream or something. It's so good. Oh, we've got a mug, yay! <laughs> Basically, I've got my uniform mugs that I showed you guys, the copper and marble ones. I've got plain white ones from when I moved in, which I'm kind of over and I actually don't really want them. I might store those away. And then I wanna have a shelf of all sorts of different mix matched mugs and I've been working on that. So this is gonna go on my top shelf to go with all of the random ones. And it says, enjoy the little things, and I absolutely enjoy the little things. I think this is gonna be my mug when I'm doing my chilled out videos and having a cup of tea, because it's so cute, it's so pretty, and it just goes with me, doesn't it? <laughs> it does. Opening this one, this is like early Christmas or late birthday presents. It's got a Made by Yasmin candle. You guys have seen Made by Yasmin on my channel before. I actually have a champagne and roses candle from Made by Yasmin in my living room. And now I have a red grape candle from Made by Yasmin. Wow. I don't know what it is, but I'm seeing copper. Let's see. Oh my gosh. Oh, so we have like copper, like paper clip things. This is gonna be really nice in my office. Let me open it so you guys can actually see. So like clip your papers and stuff together. This is so cute, guys. It says, pretty little things, PLT. It's a little dish. You could probably put this on a dressing table and put like jewelry or earrings on there. Just small little things that you don't want to lose. You know when you're cooking and then like you've got like the big spoon and stuff that you need to put down while it's cooking? I think this would actually be really cute in the kitchen as well. Mini candles from All That Wax. They're like little stars in different colors. How freaking cute is that? I've got notebooks. You guys know my obsession with notebooks, right? These are from Paper Love Mini Notebooks. Well, now I have three new notebooks. Beautiful. Oh, a nice picture frame. This is so cute as well. And it's really good because it's a white one. So it's gonna blend in perfectly with my home. I'll find the cute little print or something, or maybe like a quote. I think this is the last thing. No, it's not the last thing. One of the last things, and I'm gonna open this up, and it looks cool from here. It feels like it's glass. Let's see what it is. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, smile, sparkle, and shine. 
This is so cute. This can literally go on like, um, you know, like you can hang it on a door or something like that. So shocked right now at everything that's come in this hamper, like so many things. Okay, I've got an envelope here. I'm not too sure what it is, but let's see what it is. Oh, it's the print. So this print is gonna go into the white frame. Okay, let's try and do that now. Let's do this as quick as possible. Because sometimes, guys, I get so finicky and I take forever to do things. And I've got you guys here, so I need to do it really quickly. All right, stop talking, Jade, stop talking. Just get it done. Okay. I did it guys. Dream without fear. I absolutely love that quote because you have to dream without fear. Fear, you know, is inevitable. However, don't ever let fear stop you from dreaming and succeeding because when you fear something, it means that you're onto something big. That's the way I see it. Um, I'm gonna have to place this somewhere. And the last thing we have is this bag, also from Sass and Bell, and it seems like a shopping bag or something which you can never ever have too many of. Ooh, what would I use this for? I guess I could probably, again, use this in my pantry as like organizational, like just a lot of stuff that needs to go in bags. It's really big guys. Honestly guys, I am so, so shocked. I wasn't expecting it to have so many things in here. Like if you guys actually see what is going on over here, potentially you can get stuff like that every single month for like 20 pounds. And sadly guys, this is actually the end of the video. I've shared everything that's new and improved in my home. And I've been able to open some PR boxes for you guys. And that has honestly been really exciting for me. So I wanna say a big thank you to all of you lovely subscribers and viewers for watching this video. Stay tuned because I actually have a lot of exciting videos to come. I have had some interior clients, so I will be sharing my before and afters in their homes. I also have some vlogs coming up, and I have also persuaded my mum to come on my channel, so you guys may be seeing a video with me and my mum very, very soon. If there's something I haven't mentioned or I haven't done yet or I haven't discussed yet that you would like to see me do, leave your comments down below. I have already filmed an Instagram and Snapchat Q&A, so that will be my next video for you guys. As I've been saying for about a minute now, thank you so much guys for tuning in. Keep on sharing and subscribing and liking and commenting. I am so, so grateful. We are almost at 17,000 subscribers. And remember, when I get 20K subscribers, I'm giving away a big box, similar to that one, filled to the brim with different things. Love you all so much, and thank you for watching my video. Bye. <laughs>